Well, welcome to Slytherin. How are your first impressions? Do you feel like this is where you belong yet? Yes, Slytherin has always been special. We have our own rules here, our own culture. It's not just a faculty, it's a way of life. Not everyone gets it at first. But once you realize what it means to be a true Slytherin, there's no turning back. Cunning and ambition are just the tip of the iceberg. Yes, we've always had our goals, and we're not afraid to use any means to achieve them. But the real essence of Slytherin is survival. We know how to adapt, how to use the weaknesses of others to our advantage. This is where you learn to be not just smart, but a strategist. See this? It's a symbol not just of our faculty, but of our nature. The snake is wise, patient, but when the time comes, it strikes. Quickly, precisely, and without delay. To those who don't understand us, yes, frightening. But within our circle, you will find not fear, but strength. To be a Slytherin is to be prepared for whatever challenges life throws at you. No one will pity you for your mistakes. It teaches you that weakness is something to be managed, not shown. Oh, I realized that very quickly. Hogwarts isn't just a school of magic. It's an arena where the fittest survive. I wasn't going to be someone who was pushed or held back. Slytherin gave me the opportunity to become who I am. It teaches you to be more than just a wizard. It teaches you to be a leader. And most importantly, you must always remember that our ambitions go further than just grades or ranks. Respect is not gained here, it is earned. The first rule is, don't trust anyone completely. Even friends can betray you if it is in their interests. Second, know your goals and don't deviate from them. When you have a clear vision, you will become someone to be looked up to, even if some are afraid of you. Gryffindors, they act on instinct, not judgment. It's important for them to appear brave, but that bravery often borders on stupidity. Slytherins, on the other hand, prefer to act thoughtfully, without emotion. And you know what? We always win in the long run. We think ahead, instead of rushing into battle with our swords drawn. Strategy and control. Here you will learn to control not only the situation, but also yourself. Thoughts must be clear and emotions must be under control. This is what separates a true Slytherin from the rest. They can laugh or get angry and you'll know how to exploit their weaknesses. And this is the heart of Slytherin. This is where you will spend most of your time. This is where you will either grow stronger or fade into the shadows. It's up to you to decide which you want to be. Okay. The first step is to recognize that you have ambitions. The second is to do everything you can to make it a reality. But take your time. You have your whole life ahead of you to achieve your goals. And remember, weakness is not forgiven in this world. Are you ready? Go on then. Let Slytherin be your strength and your weapon. <laughs>